Hello everybody. Welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer. I shot this image for a long time ago. Well, this is my subject today and uh, I tried to make some the oil paint like image with this base image and also I have this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop. Use filter called Find Edges. And uh, well, I don't know what the image is gonna be. I'm excited about this. Okay, let's get started. I'm gonna make duplicate of this base image. Then uh, I'm gonna, well, change the layer mode normal to darken so we can see pencil drawing type image and also the base image too okay I'm going to turn this base image first one turn it off to keep it then I'm going to use oil paint brush to make something like smudging type okay now I'm going to work on here go for background first Select that uh, oil paint brush this time. I'm gonna go well, oil paint round first. Let's see. Then, no paint, just texture on this. And uh, well, convert to pixel layer to touch it. Okay. Mixed colors, pretty interesting though. Yeah, this is great. Touch it, this pixels as if like the oil paint is already painted. So, movement and texture of the paint as uh, using the oil paint brush to move and uh, mix up with next color that's really amazing to mix this i'm gonna touch faces models faces later that's the last last thing to do i'm gonna be careful with it Okay, now I go model the faces. Small brush texture and uh, okay, I'm gonna change the brush to oil paint filbert. Then a little bit small.
go back to oil paint around to touch some hair. Overall models. Okay, I'm gonna touch the highlight area later, but now I'm gonna do background. We're changing, well, let's see, oil paint chunky. Maybe bigger size of the brushes. Nice for background because touch is pretty big. Just blend to outside. Okay, overall, I'm going to touch up some. Okay, now. Well, what's next now? Let's see. I'm going to change this pencil drawing type image. It's now just 100% opacity and darken. Well, over there, you see the highlight side. More lighten up and uh, punch out. So, okay, I'm going to use overlay first. Well, I'm going to make duplicate layer then one for overlay then turn this one off now now i'm going to continue from here again change color burn color burn goes darker i want to see it's interesting to see these black lines this show color burn goes more this reddish effect. Well, I'm gonna use color burn now then. Okay. Or 100% more punch. Okay, these two layers. Overlay gives you more highlight side punch. About 30%. This color burn gives you more dark side contrast and the color wise that's effect give it 100 max and if i turn this two off then it shows normal tone so basic image is this but the uh, highlight area i want to emphasize with this overlay so i'm going to turn on then create empty mask invert mask and also this color burn turn on then create empty mask then invert mask now let's see like i'm going to reveal with brush is going to be basic soft run size flow this guy's shoulder. And highlight. And hair. Like. See the top light.
Review these areas on this filter. I guess that's it. Okay, now this one, color burn. Now darker area, shadow area. And also, also show the black lines. Hmm, touch more punch. Okay. Now, what's next? Well, I must see a layer then if I can see interesting effect from color blend mode change, blend mode normal to color then I add to show more amber color Now this layer is doing emphasize color. I'm adding amber color now orange, especially her face. Give it a more warm tone. And also their lips. and texture. Let's see. White 100% on this layer. Let's see. Well, I guess that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video. Yeah, that's it. Thank you and uh, I really appreciate for you guys support and you guys have a nice day. Wow, thank you again and see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.